Hi guys, it is Dr. Cody Dukes and we are back again for yet another video. Now you already know what to do. If you haven't done so already, please go ahead and like this video. And if you're not already, please go ahead and subscribe to this channel. Now you already know what today is. It's Fit Friday and you know what we do on Fit Fridays. We do more fitness related content, more health related content where I give you guys tips and tricks on things that I did to help me get more fit, to help me get more healthy that might also work for you and today is no different. Today, I want to talk about one of my all-time favorite movies, and it stars Jim Carrey, and it's called The Truman Show. Now, The Truman Show follows this guy who was basically born inside of a TV show. It's like a pseudo-reality show where this guy is allowed to grow up and live his life, but it's all within the confines of this huge dome-sized movie studio, and everyone inside of it you know, inside of this town is an actor except for the main guy uh, who's just thinks that he's living a normal life. Um, and as he, as he grows up and as he, you know, he gets married and he grows through life, he gets to this point where he starts to realize that things are a bit weird. And he starts to realize that people act weirdly towards him and that people seem to focus on him and that uh, strange things happened. And I think the main catalyst was when a former actor who played his dad, who died when he was little, <laughs> snuck back on the set and and ran into him, you know, in the middle of the street. And so he finally starts to realize that something's not right, something's going on, and he starts to try to break out. And he tries to break out in every way that he tries to go to leave is blocked off it's like he goes to see a travel agent all the flights are booked for the next year right uh he he tries to go uh on the road and traffic is horrible there's some type of uh plant uh explosion that's causing pollution he can't go on the road and he has this extreme fear of water and so the producers are pretty sure he won't go on boat so it's almost like he's trapped He's stuck and he can't get out. But he, in his mind, he knows I need to leave this town. And eventually he just says, you know what? I'm going to escape and I'm going to get on a boat. <laughs> his biggest fear because his dad died uh, via water, a big, you know, storm. Water, and so he decided he would never you know, he, he had a, a extreme fear of water. So when he got on this boat, he's terrified and they board him. They almost kill him because they control the weather inside of this studio. They almost kill him. But eventually he makes it to the edge of the studio and he leaves. And the reason I'm talking about this today is because sometimes a lot like Truman in the Truman Show, we on our fitness journeys, we hit what they call a plateau where we've been doing well, but it seems like what we've been doing has gotten us all of the results it can get us. And we're not seeing any gains. We're not seeing any weight loss or muscle, you know, growth or whatever it is we're trying to accomplish. Our endurance isn't changing. Whatever it is, it seems like we can't get through that. We're, we're stuck. And, you know, we're open to making changes, but it seems like all the things that we try to do <laughs> is just like blocked, blocked, blocked. But you have to be like Truman in that you got to find a way around. You have to figure out what it is that you're not doing that you could be doing. You have to figure out what it is that you are doing that's worked for so very long that you're probably gonna ha maybe have to let go because it's not gonna work anymore. Maybe you're gonna have to intensify it to a whole nother level that maybe you weren't prepared to do it. I've experienced this before. I'm experiencing it now. And if you wanna get through 
you probably just gonna have to do something you just really don't want to do. I remember my first time around losing weight. I remember I got to this point where I was just like stuck and I wasn't, you know, I wasn't losing anymore. I wasn't gaining weight, but I, you know, I was still working out, but I wasn't losing any weight and I wanted to lose some more weight. And I remember I was like, you know what? You just gonna have to start throwing in intermittent fasting. <laughs> and it was hard. And I don't know that I really wanted to do it. And you know what? I was super committed at the time. So I probably was like, I'll do it. But it's not like fasting isn't something that you want to do. But it's something that I was like, I just have to do what I had to do if I want to get the results I want to get. And, and, and there are going to be some things like that. Some of you who don't like cardio, you may just have to do it. <laughs> Those of you who don't like lifting heavy weights, you may just have to do it. You don't like cutting out 90% of the carbs from your diet. You may just have to do it. You don't like drinking protein and, you know, sup taking supplements. You may just have to do it. You may have to get in that boat, even though it, it, it was one of his biggest fears. He watched his dad die from water. It was one of his biggest fears, but he still got on that boat because it meant more to him to get the result he was after. And you may have to do something you really, really dread doing. But if the results mean more to you, then the dread does deter you. You're going to do what you have to do. That's the video, guys. If you haven't done so already, please go ahead and like this video. And if you're not already, please subscribe to my channel. I'm uploading five videos a week. That's one every single weekday. I do inspirational and motivational content with a pop culture twist. I look at things like sports, movies, anime, superheroes, cartoons, game shows, you name it. I just try to find a motivational message that I can deliver to you in a way that's easy to understand so that you can take it and use it in your daily life so that you can be successful. And if that sounds like what you're trying to do, then you should definitely subscribe because this is the channel for you. Guys, how did I do? Let me know down in the comments. Give me tips and feedback on how I can get better. Give me suggestions on topics I should cover in the future. I'll do my best to go through every single comment and get back to every single one of you guys. Guys, I thank you for sticking around this long and I appreciate all of the support. And the only thing I ask is that you keep coming back because I'll keep coming back with more videos just like this one, just for you. And as I always say, guys, until next time, peace.